Hey guys! Welcome back to my channel! I know I look a bit weird, but I'm going to focus on the intro. So, I am going to film the intro. Today, I'll be doing the how I did my makeup before. So, here's a sneak peek. Oh, <laughs> lang ng video. I just forgot the intro. So, um, uh, today I will show you how I used to do my makeup in high school, college, and when I was working. So, sneak peek. And kung gusto niyo ring malaman kung paano ko nag uh, makeup before, just keep on watching. Okay, so in first year high school, or I don't know, grade six until first year high school, I looked like this. Um, I used to apply baby powder over my face, so my face was literally whiter than my neck. And well, my face was definitely a lot better looking than how my face looks like right now. And I would apply eyeliner all over my upper and lower like lash line and I'd make it really thick and bold and my eyes literally look like this then I'd part my hair in the middle most of the time I had really I mean I still do really wavy hair and it was very hug hug and it was just this short most of the time so this is how it looked like first year to about second year high school. Well, at least when I go out or when I apply makeup. And then since my cousin gave me some lip gloss, I added that to my routine. So I had like really dark eyes and then really glossy lips. And then I'd apply everything super sloppy. So this is how it looked like. Most of the time, if you see me out, like grade 6, first year high school, second year high school, this, this face. Now, if I did not wear my hair like this, I would put it in a low ponytail. So I look something like this, except thinner and with way better skin. Not much has changed when I like reached third year high school. Since um, ganito pa yung face ko, usually I would cover my face with baby powder and ah, pero na pala akong clean and clear na compact noon. That's a, that was my first compact ever and I loved it to pieces. Pero wala akong clean and clear na compact ngayon so I just used baby powder. And then for the eyeliner, I just applied like a bold line right here. I just used a pencil eyeliner so it would go under my lash line so kita niyo medyo black din yung dito ko ngayon. Um, I did that on purpose kasi ganito naman talaga yung look ko before. And then sometimes I would use a lip gloss or I would use a lip balm. Yun lang. And then for the hair, still the same dito pa rin yung part talaga sa middle. And I would just put my hair like this. Para medyo girly naman tingnan. So this is how it looked like. Um, third year high school to about fourth year high school. I'm not sure, but to the best of my recollection, ganito yung itsura ko. And then I had a lot, as in a lot of accessories on, like, punong puno talaga yung arms ko. And I always had um, colored contacts on mga third year or fourth year high school. So, yeah, ganito yung look ko before. Mm, oh, and I always managed to wear black talaga, especially no high school. And kahit no ano, um, Mga grade 5 ago, grade 6, I always wore black because I was like a punk kid or whatever, so good on. <laughs> Yuck. Okay, now let's move on to the good stuff the college makeup. Now, no college, shampre medyo. Dalaga na ako since 17 na nga and going to the big city for college. So, my hair was a side part na kasi. So, I had a But in college, mostly I had short hair and I was always straight yon or pinapa straight. At least in starting third year or fourth year college because I had a budget. Na ako nun. <laughs> but in first year, second year, I was just hair ko, like wavy and whatnot. First year college, I never really wore a lot of makeup. I was just using clean and clear na compact or the Maybelline na nasa light green na compact. Yung, I forgot my name. Clear Smooth Shine Free Face Powder in Natural. Yes, yun yung lagi kong ginagamit sa face ko. Just that. And I always applied a tinted lip balm. Yung lagi kong gamit is from Avon. Kaya lang wala ako noon. So I have here the Burt's Bees Tinted Lip Balm. Ito yung lagi kong ginagamit noong first year. 
just like that. And I looked like this first year of college. Pero mas nene ako nung siyempre. Ayan. And then no second year, I think second year ako nag-start nitong um, cheek tint. Pero the one I had is from Avon. Pero wala ako nun. I have here the Fashion 21 Lip and Cheek Tint. So every single day, naglalagay ako ng cheek tint. Oh! Naglalagay ako ng cheek tint every single day. Naalala ko pa noon yung mama ko naging um, retailer sa Avon. Tapos, ito yung lagi kong pinapabili sa kanya kapag pumupunta siya sa Avon. Tsaka yung Simply Pretty na powder. Even though, I don't really like that. Yan yung lagi niyang binibili para sa akin kasi mura. Mas mura compared doon sa Maybelline and Clean and Clear. So, there we go. Ewan ko kung napasobrahan ko yung cheek tint kasi I don't really use cheek, cheek, cheek tint anymore. So, ito. This was my look. Kaya. Second year college, siguro. Ganito yung look ko. And then, um, siguro third year or fourth year. I don't know. Nag-start na ako na mag-wear ng mascara. Pero, hindi ako nagka-curlash. Siguro minsan kapag may mahiram ako na curlash. And I use this, this one talaga. Itong, this exact mascara. It's the Avon Simply Pretty Full Lash Mascara. I don't know kung ito yun. Pero Simply Pretty na mascara ng Avon. Tapos iba pa yung packaging nun. 179 pesos. Yes, naaalala ko. Binibili ko dun sa mga studyante nagbebenta ng Avon sa school namin. Kasi hindi na retailer ng Avon yung mama ko at that time. So, I think I just applied one coat of mascara noong um, college pa ako. Tapos dito lang sa upper lashes. Ganyan. Pero mostly guys, ginagawa ko to like yung mascara sa school na kasi wala na akong time sa morning kapag um, pupunta ako sa school. Kasi yung school ko, ang layo-layo dito sa bahay na may nakakaloka. Nagjijip lang ako noon. Tapos ang layo-layo. Um, sometimes, most of the time, magpa-ferry boat ako para pagdating ko sa school, hindi ako amoy ano. Hindi ako amoy uksok ng jeep. Tapos, um, sabi ko nga sa mama ko, pwede ba ako mag-dorm na lang kasi ang layo-layo ng bahay natin sa school ko. Ah, uh, ayaw niya. Kasi sabi niya, bakit? Eh, may bahay ka naman. Bakit ka mag-ano ako mag-dorm? So, yun. My mom and dad are so strict. Kahit ngayon, medyo strict to pa rin sila ka. Kapag matagal akong umuwi, bakit lang tayo umuwi? Sakto bang oras yun na pa-umuwi ng, ano, ng, like, proper na lady daw. So, yun. So, this is how I look like most of the time noong 3rd year, 3rd year siguro. And then, meron akong na Harvat na, ano, na kilay kit from my mom. I actually still have it. Wait, hahanapin ko. Here guys, it's this one. I think you are familiar with this kasi ginagamit ko pa to noon. Like, in my old tutorials, ginagamit ko pa to. Kasi hindi talaga ko mahilig magkilay. And then, um, binigay ito ng mama ko. As you can see, super wala na siyang laman. But I will use it again today. Ito yung lagi kong ginagamit as in. Tapos, yung kilay ko, kaloka, parang ang pangit-pangit. I'll try to do what I used to do before. Super harsh ng kilay ko dito sa start ng brow. Tapos, noon, I never did my brows. Like, I don't lock my brows at all. So, medyo mas thick yung brows ko noon. And, I think mga third year, fourth year, ganon, nag-ano na ako ulit. Nagka-colored contact. So, ganyan lang. Totally, walang ka-arte-arte yung brows ko. Like, walang fade-fade. Walang ano. Basta, pag mag-drawing ako ng ganyan, yun na yun. Tapos, isang color lang talaga lahat ng kilay. Walang pa-fade-fade na gano'n. Tapos, I didn't really care kung matulis ba yung dito. Basta may kulay dyan, okay na. Tapos, I didn't care kung, um, kung pantay ba sila or what. Basta, merong kilay dyan, may product, okay na ako. Ayan, so let's just say na ganito yung kilay ko noon. Like, walang patutunguhan talaga. Hmm? Walang brush-brush, walang spoolie-spoolie, like... Basta't ma-drawing ko lang siya ng ganyan, okay na siya. So, yan. <laughs> and then, on special events, I would actually apply a shimmery white eyeshadow on my eyelid. Like, acquaintance party or basta kapag feel ko na mag-eyeshadow. So, ginagamit ko lang yung finger ko. Tapos, ilalagay ko siya dito sa eyelid. 
kalimutan ko na yung ginamit ko. I think it's um from Caroline yung old packaging nila. Tapos I would drag it up to the brow bone yung shimmery white eyeshadow. I don't know why I thought that this was a good look, pero ganyan. Tapos wala pa rin foundation foundation noon or BB cream kasi hindi ko alam yung mga ganun noon. Powder lang talaga ako. Minsan, I would just apply a cream eyeshadow or something else. Pero isang color lang talaga. But most of the time, puti talaga yung ginagamit ko na shimmery. So, I would look something like this. <laughs> Nagkakaloka. And then, um, after that, I applied liquid eyeliner. Siguro starting... Nakalimutan ko na, basta college. Kapag merong parang okasyon or gusto ko lang mag-makeup, I applied liquid eyeliner. I think my go-to was the um, Fashion 21 liquid eyeliner. Kasi yun yung binigay ng mama ko na eyeliner sa akin. Or I used the Nichido eyeliner kasi cheap lang siya. Or yung EB na dip liner. Yung mga mumurahin lang talaga yung afford ko lang sa baon ko. So, I would apply liquid liner, pero hindi pa ako marunong mag-wing on you guys. So, my liner was a bit thick. Tapos, I did not really care kung pantay sila or kung smooth yung eyeliner ko. Tapos, I just ended it right here. Diyan lang talaga. Walang flick noon, walang wing-wing. Basta, niline mo yung eyes mo. Ganun lang. Tapos, I always did a thick line. I don't know why. So, my eyes look a lot smaller. Again, most of the time, nilalagay ko itong makeup ko noong college. Kapag ando na ako sa school, um, minsan doon na sa classroom, yung naghihintay ng klase, or sa library. Doon ako madalas mag-makeup kasi aircon. So, now we just need to let this dry. And... Lipstick. I never really wore lipstick. I think I did not. Siguro super minsan lang. Pero um, usually I remember na nagaano lang ako ng tinted lip balm. Minsan lang ako mag lipstick. So yun. Ganito na yung look ko guys. Yeah, usually nung college ako, ganito na yung look ko. Kapag may acquaintance party. Pero again, mostly straight yung hair ko nung college. At least as far as I can remember mga third or fourth year. Madalas sa pictures ko, straight yung hair ko. So, siguro straight yung hair ko. Yun. Tapos, usually short siya. And, I mostly look like this kapag nagme-makeup ako noon. <laughs> Kahit na nung nagtatrabaho na ako, hindi nag-level up yung aking uh, makeup skills. Ganito pa rin. I thought that this looked good before. And, what a sad, sad mistake that was. <sighs> yeah. Yan na yun, guys. This is how I look like before. Um, this is how I used to do my makeup. And, makakaloka. Yeah! Um, sana nag-enjoy kayo guys sa video na ito. I look really weird right now. But, if you enjoyed watching, please give me a thumbs up. And, don't forget to subscribe to my channel para kasali kayo sa Pilin Aina family. And, leave me your comments in the comment section below para malaman ko kung nagustuhan niyo naman itong video na to. And, and that always happened to me. My transfer talaga na eyeliner sa eyelid ko. Kasi I never waited for my eyeliner to dry or yung ginagamit ko pencil and the transfer siya kasi hooded yung eyelids ko. So that was always there. This one, yung transfer ng aking eyeliner. Also, don't forget to click the notification bell para ikay manolify every time I upload a new video which is every other day. Sometimes even more para wala ka mamiss na BG. And I believe that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I love you all. And hopefully, I will see you in the next one. Bye. Hey, guys. Welcome back to my channel. So, I'm going to earbuds now. Because as you can see naman from the title, this is going to be a get ready with me. Diba? So, syempre, I'm going to earbuds. I'm going to get earbuds. As you can see from the title, this is a get ready with me. Diba? But,